video we are going to look at how we can automatically build multiple agent system without manually creating them all right so we are going to use agent auto build which is a pipeline designed to automate the construction of multiple agent system which is tailored for accomplishing a task so this innovative approach introduces a class named agent builder so the agent builder is responsible for seamlessly generating expert agent based on user provided description of building and executing tax so once the tax is initiated the agent builder not only craft individual participant agent but also automatically assembles a group chat streamlining the entire process so i'm going to walk you through how you can easily create this agent without manually creating them all right so this is the structure for the auto build so in here the user will keep a tax to the building a building tax just like a prompt and it assigns this to our create agents assign it to the agent builder who is going to decide on which agents to build with a tax so it assigns its attacks for it to be accomplished so there is an interaction between these agents in order to complete the tax so they are within the group chat so if there is a code that needs to be executed the code is executed all right so the entire tax is executed as you can see and the results is popped out okay so i'm going to walk you through an example in a use case how this is done all right so in my vs code i've already had a setup all right so in here we need to install the requirement okay so you need to install oxygen using this command this will install the latest oxygen all right so when you hit enter i've already had that installed so when you hit enter it should install the latest oxygen all right so the next thing we need to do now is to set up the config so in here i have my config and i'm going to use the model the gpt all right so you see here for the preview version and i have my api key okay so the next thing we have to do is let's go to the pi.py all right so let me drag this here i'm going to walk you through that all right so in here we import autogen and from autogen.agentchat.contrib we are going to use the agent builder that is going to help us accomplish the tax so we set up the configuration so they set the config the config pack path which is equal to this right here and the config list we assign that to the config path right so the next thing is create a default config and we pass the temperature to be zero so we initialize the builder so in here we say the agent builder is equal to the config path and the builder model is equal to the selected model All right so the next thing is to create the building agents so we call the building tax and we pass the tax to them so we say develop a basic tax management system in python for a restaurant so it can be any other tax that you want to be accomplished so we now create our agent list and the agent config for the task and we call the use the build so in the build so the build is to let the build manager complete the group chat agent generation 
So if you think that you are going to need a code in that application, you say coding is equal to true. Okay. All right, so we pass our default LLM config. And the next thing is to create the multi-agent group chat. So we create a variable called a group chat and we pass the agents list in here and we make the maximum round to be equal to 12. All right, so the next thing is we create variable called a manager and we pass our group chat is equal to group chat and the LM config that we have already set up. Okay, and we pass the config list and the default LLM config in there. All right, so what we want to do now is to assign, start the tags with the first agent and initiate the chat with the manager, and we pass the message in there, develop a basic tax management system in Python for restaurant. So another option is if you want to clear all the agent to start the next tax, you can initiate this command, builder.clear all agent, recycle and point is equal to true. And if you want to save all the necessary information of the build agent group chat, we assign this to the path. So that's it. So let's run it. I'm going to say bye. Python. Bye. And I hit, hit enter. All right, perfect. All right, so as you can see, all right, so let me walk you through this. It started preparing the create, so it created the agent automatically. Those who are going to accomplish the tax, the system analyst, the quality assurance tester, the software developer with the backbone of the model, the software analyst with backbone of the model, and the quality assurance tester with backbone. Okay, so. It started with the user console and Python code interpreter to the manager. All right. So we say develop basic tax manager system in Python for restaurant. So the software developer to the manager. All right. To develop a basic tax management system for restaurant using, you would need to create a simple console application that to handle. All right, guys, I think this is very useful. You don't have to create these agents manually. So you just assign that to the um, auto build and it's going to do that exactly. All right, so it creates a file, pi file, and assign the code for that. All right, so it creates a function for each the list tags, the update tags, task, the delete task, right? And the dev task. The dev main is assigned the code to create that. Right, that's awesome. I think, uh, yeah, I've not run it, but uh, so yeah, it's showing a very positive feedback. So to use this tax management system, save the script to a file name tax management.py and run it using the Python interpreter. So please note, this is a basic implementation and does not include. Okay, so I said it should just do a basic um, tax management, which it has done. And it terminate and then on to the system analyst. Basic tax Python has been concluded. So the system anal analyst is giving the feedback. It has been concluded and a script provided. So it created a script. So the script offers a simple console-based interface for management sys managing tax, including adding right and the quality assurance tester. Also, here it terminates the process. And like I said, so the building config is saved. So as you can see, okay. So let me open it and see. All right. All right, so let me open this up. I think it's open here. Okay, so this is how it saves the task. All right, so it's giving the tax for each of the agent. All right, awesome. 
right so guys this is what i wanted to show you how easy it is to just create automatically create your agents just giving it a, a building tax prompt all right so i hope you like this video don't forget to share and subscribe so i'll be coming your way with the um open source application of this project